This is Ghirardelli Square, a perfect setting for a lot of those movies and television series. Among them, Trapper Fox. <laughs> <coughs> uh, I can see it now. Young man interest in... <laughs> Good evening, I'm Richard Hart. And I'm Jan Yanaheep. <coughs> Forgot my name. Are you going to... I thought you were going to start. You want me to start? <laughs> so how should I start it now? Oh, let me start it. You start it then. No, I think it's really better if you start it. Do you want me to start? <laughs> <laughs> okay, as that old saying goes, if at first you don't succeed, try, try again. Okay, we're rolling. Take one on the close. Jan talks first. Take five. The first game is an away game, but it'll be here. Uh, uh. <laughs> Take eight. I'm sorry. I blow it. I'll do this right. Take ten. Take eleven. April 9th, you'll be able to... <laughs> oh, God, help me, help me. Just call them, just call them, don't call them. Just drop by between 11 and 9. Take 13, and it's just up the street from the crab pot, right? Six. And they're open, no? Clam house. <laughs> we'll never finish this. Now, it may seem like fun and games at times, but we take our work very seriously. Those big wheels can get expensive for the truckers. They cost as much as $400 each to replace. Well, I can't remember. They certainly do. <laughs> you know what? All right, let me go get Someday it. what you're let doing will turn into an outtake. Those people out there right now are saying... I will be back. Let me go get a drink of water. God! Jan will be back in just a minute. In the meantime, let me tell you that if you want to know more about the Chabot Observatory, call her at home. The number is 555-4738. I think that's your phone ringing. <laughs> Sometimes, even if you get your part right, things still don't fall into place. Probably the oldest toy that is still in big demand is play... Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> Sorry about that. Also, the whale's heart beats only nine times a minute. The fastest fish in the world is the... And there is probably one thing, though, Richard, that we wanted to do that we probably shouldn't have. That is to dare to presume that we could sing. Start spreading news. Ha, 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 ha. I'm leaving today. Hey, is Moscow on Hudson, no? <laughs> Working nine to five. What a way to make a living. <laughs> and seven million tax dollars later as this project is getting ready to wave its final goodbye i said getting ready didn't i yeah. take number two three two one it is now several years and at least seven million tax dollars later as this project is getting ready to wave its file uh, it is now several years and at least seven million tax dollars later as this project is getting ready to <laughs> <laughs> getting wetty. I'm going to leave them all because I want everybody to see what I'm next. <laughs> Shut up. All right, let's get you please, Al. Don't do it. Get All sides. Five yards. Clipping. <laughs> okay. All right, eight. Three, two, one. It is now several years and at least seven million tax dollars later. <laughs> Number nine, three, two, one. It is. Don't do that, Jeff. <laughs> hey, man, why are you show your dinghy at me? <laughs> Listen. I gotta get in. Come on. <laughs> and we'll just take the front ones. <laughs> we'll just take the front ones. Let it go at that. I, I can't do it. <laughs> What's this white stuff on my knuckles? <laughs> okay. <laughs> 
Okay. This is it. First and ten. Jeffrey, please don't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> We're not going to even look at you. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> okay. Wait a minute. You got the microphone up at the picture. <laughs> Check that out, Alan. All one in the picture. Yeah, the microphone is on. Three, two, one. <laughs> Hi, this is Mike Hegedus reporting live and direct from Atka Island in the Aleutians. Okay. This, we've found Beverly Hopkins. <laughs> uh, I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir, folks. Moose. Any moose meat here? <laughs> okay, oh. set. Can't do this. Okay, here we go. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> okay, here we go. This is a take. Here we go. This is a take. Oh boy. Okay. This is a take. And there's more to the Larry Thomas Hopkins story today. And just put. I say, oh yeah, I see. And I said, the vice president has one of his balls for you oh. too. <laughs> These are the doors through which someone told me this morning I couldn't go through until the news conference for San Francisco Assemblyman Charlie Myers was concluded. I went through those doors. Later this month, divers will be going down with an underwater vacuum-like machine. That will suck the sand off the wreckage and will give park rangers a better idea of exactly what's down there. <laughs> Mr. Hirsch, you indicated in your speech that you were against a pullout of American forces from Vietnam at this time. Why? You said that our efforts in Vietnam were beginning to pay off more now than ever before. Yes. And I took it by that, that you were against a pullout of American forces at this time from Vietnam. You mean a first move out unilaterally? Well, I, you didn't use the word unilaterally. Well, I'm using it now. I don't know I what your conditions were. I wasn't going to add that in it. I don't, I don't know. Or are you against a pullout of American yes. forces? Why? Because I believe we should finish the job or try and get a negotiated peace out of this, not a one-sided retreat. Well, the negotiations are, are... Now, wait a minute. Are we in an argument about no. your views and mine? Or of are you course not. I'm me? trying to interview you. That's all. If, if you ask me to try and convince cut, you of something, cut. and no. you come at it in this spirit, no, I, I ain't going to. No, I just want to ask you a question, and you hesitated to answer, and I thought you didn't understand the question. I just didn't know where yeah. you were asking from. Right now, let's pretend to go to the zoo. Will you gallop along with us, friend? Up or a broom that you can use as your horse. Why don't you? Oh, gosh. We'll have to stop. Who are you okay, sweetheart? And they can't see it, huh? And I'm going to put him so you can see his, that's his tummy. And you can see he's got pretty long legs in the back there, doesn't he? To use those for jumping? They're... Most toads don't jump much. It does jump, but mm -hmm. it's more of a walker. My goodness. And they can swim well. Okay, let me see. Danielle, do you want to put your hand up and touch him? No, who wants no. to touch him? Anyone? Me. Okay, get real, real gently. <laughs> no words. No words. That's right. You want to touch him, Rika? How does he feel? Does he feel? Oh. <laughs> well, he was in the water, and now he's out of the water. Now we're going to put him back in his. Say bye bye to Mr. Toad. <laughs> oh well.